Hey my tribe, welcome back once again to our channel. Um, I thought it might be nice today to pull a card from the Oracle of the oops, Oracle of the Mermaids deck by Lucy Cavendish. Um, it says on the back here, open your heart, hear their song, heal your love life. Mermaids have long been the luscious messengers between the world of the ocean and the world of humans. Loving, adventurous, kind, and darling, mermaids can teach you ways to heal your past, love yourself more deeply, live authentically, embrace your creativity, and find your life's purpose. When you connect with your mermaids, you tap into the vast reservoir of the feminine divine, which in turn enhances your ability to draw love into your life, raise your self-esteem, create sensual bliss, and glow with health and attractive vitality. So, yeah, I mean, I'm, I've shared on this channel before that um, I connected very <laughs> strongly in childhood with the Little Mermaid, and I just, um, I don't know, from there on, I just made a promise to myself to never forget my magic, and that's what left led me here today. Um, so, yeah, this was actually also the first deck that I bought, um, the first Oracle deck that I bought uh, happened during like right when COVID first started. So yeah, let's see what we have today. The mirror. Know thyself, self-examination, seeing who you really are. And let's see, what does the book have to say about the mirror? What number is this? Is there a number? 21. <clears throat> The mirror message know thyself self-examination seeing who you really are the mermaids sing water is a great mirror and the darker it is the clearer the reflection of the world around it will be and so it is with life the clear mirror we can look into will show us who we appear to be but the dark mirror metaphorically is when life or the sea or our feelings become darker more complex sad thoughtful deep and at times very painful but it is at these times that we can see who we truly are, for under duress our true character can be observed, and sometimes we do not always like the truth of what we see in this dark mirror, but the mermaid can help us with this, as she holds up a mirror, but a magical one, that not only shows us our appearance, but shows all of ourselves, our sweetness, our hurt, and our scars. In it we may see what is hidden to the eye of the body, but known to the eyes of the soul. In dreams, these mirrors may appear, and in emotional times when we realize that we're still hurting or have wounds we have sought to cover up. There is no need to cover up or camouflage in this beautiful mirror, nor is it right to judge the scars and woundings, or the beauty and the glory. They simply are, and by seeing clearly, especially in the dark mirror of the great mother ocean, we can see who we are. While we swim in clear waters, we can see the light and the positive. But when we swim in the dark waters, we can truthfully see so much of who we are and make changes, adaptations, or come to accept the truth of who we are without seeking to adjust. We come to self-love, self-knowledge, and self-healing. I'm not going to do the reverse to this because it's an oracle card. I don't want to, I just, I don't want to pull into that energy for this one. So let's just do the divination. It is time to gently yet firmly see the truth about who you are and to understand that who you are is not ugly or lacking, but a truthful, beautiful, wonder-laden voyage into the soul. It is time to be shown what the eye cannot always see, but what the spirit has sent. This may come through observations, loving words from friends who are truly able to see you, from a stranger who notices something that too many overlook, or that can or it can come in a moment when you glimpse who you have become dreams visions and flashes of intuition are also the mirrors that work with us at this time mirrors and who you appear to be will be coming up for you be sure to embrace the mirror in the magical mermaid's tool as an ally and wonders and healing will unfold i love this this is so gorgeous and i do have the reverse here if you'd like to maybe pause it and read it if you feel like that energy resonates with you but in order to keep this <laughs> not long-winded and also um more on the upright energy side just for the general collective yes we're going to keep it this way but i absolutely love this me this um 
message here. It's, it kind of reminds me of the feeling of, you know, if you're trying to find who you are and you're not sure exactly who that is, sometimes the best way to lead you there is to know who you aren't, right? And sometimes you do have to face... I'm hearing like Michael Jackson, I'm looking at the man in the mirror. I'm not going to start singing, Spirit said don't do that. But yeah, you have to just really take a hard look in the mirror sometimes. Alright everybody, I hope you have a great day.